Alright, what is up YouTube? Alien Horizon 02 here playing some Pokemon Sword and Shield, specifically Pokemon Sword for Nintendo Switch. And what we're going to be demonstrating today is going to be the second gym leader battle, which is a water gym. So you're going to want to be using either a grass or electric team, or just anything that's a higher level than level 20, because each of the Pokemon in this gym are going to be roughly level 20. So the obstacle for this gym is basically a maze with the match button sequence, kind of similar to the Goldenrod City for second gen in the basement. We had to press the switches to match the certain sequence so the path that you'd be able to follow through to the end is opened up. And so we are going to be showing some of that with the explanation and then just skipping right to the gym leader battle with Nessa. And the first thing that you're going to be up against is a Goldeen level 22 and then an Aracuda at level 23 and a Dreadnought level 24. And before we get any further guys, don't forget to give a like and subscribe and leave a comment down below if there's anything for this game that you would like to see in particular. And hit the bell to receive notifications if you enjoyed our content and would like to see more. So here we are with the gym leader at Nessa. And like I said before, we're just going to be up against a Goldeen and Aracuda and a Dreadnought and we we're going to be using our Dynamax all the way at the end and we confused Dreadnought the whole time during his Dynamax so he was not able to attack so that was just a specific strategy that we implemented for the second gym. Stay tuned for all the other content that we're working on right now so this is our Tekken 7 series. We're going to be posting a Call of Duty Black Ops 4 video pretty soon and some other stuff so stay tuned for much more and thanks for checking it out.
city.